All right, y'all, I am in Escondido, California, super pumped today because I am going to finally pick up an Xbox One kiosk, but it is from the almighty Toys R Us. Hi there, friends, it's Jeffrey. When you come to Toys R Us, you can meet me, along with Gigi and little baby G, and wait till you hear who else you can see. I met someone who watches the show recently who told me he was a Toys R Us employee, and he has an Xbox One, not for resale, not retail, Xbox One kiosk. So I'm super excited. I'm here with the family. We're staying at a resort. We're having a great time. We made a trip out of it, actually, and then we're going to get it in a little bit. Going to go to the pool now and have some fun, but... When the time comes to pick it up, I shall show y'all, and I promise you're gonna like it. Well, I hope so, because I'm it. Welcome to the show. By the way, we are staying at the Welks Resort, and it is a pretty dope place. Really like it, really happy I was able to bring the family for the weekend and let them have a good time with me. So this isn't part of the pickup or anything, but I'm with my family and we're in Old Town Temecula. And it's crazy how many old antique stores they are, along with like barcades, actually. There's one right there across the street called the Coin Op. And then also there was a place called the Retro Store, which had toys and comics and stuff like that as well, just down the street. So very surprising how much cool stuff this town had. Oh, and check this out. Look at this guy's helmet right there. He's got the full-on Predator mask on. Yes! Okay, but now it's time to go get the key off. Also, you can't go in an old antique town without going into an old school candy store. I'm, I'm aware this is new, but I'm tempted to get this. I am here, here to get it. How works we pull up? What's up, man? How are you? What's up, man? Nice to meet you. So, sir. Do you mind telling us uh, about this Xbox kiosk or how you got it? Or... Yeah, sure. So, my name's Gabriel. I'm not much of a video game collector of any sort, but I did come across you guys number back when you guys were still Retro Liberty. Oh, wow. Okay, awesome. And, um, but yeah, for years I worked for Toys R Us <sighs> off and on. Awesome. And then 2018 when everything went sour yep. pretty much. It's just say it's more or less it was my going away present from Toys R Us. Wow, so, that is awesome. Yeah. That is so cool. That makes it so much cooler to me yeah, that it's definitely. from Toys R Us. So. Oh, oh, you put me on the TV? <laughs> Dude, this is sick. Wow, this is cooler than I was thinking, man. Yeah. Oh my gosh, so everything lights up. Yeah. Wow. And I liked what you showed me on here. It has this. Yeah. The four, and then there's it's another that, one on the Xbox, right? On the actual Xbox. So. Wow, that is there too. Is why I know the lighting is very gloomy there, but yeah. wow. That is so awesome, dude. I cannot wait to load this thing up. You were just telling me this is yeah. the original TV, correct? Yeah, this that is came the with this. original TV that came with it. Uh, actually, I had to bust the stickers when I was transporting it originally. Oh, God. oh the, the stickers right here. Yes, right. yes, yes. Those I are see. all the transport, like, do not touch. Got and it. Is, and you said there's even a security cable in here? There's a security cable for this remote that feeds through here. I took it off because this was my normal TV. Yeah. I would it, use this for That was for background. You're not yeah. worried about your wife stealing it. <laughs> right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, and that's the thing. Um, it still has the original controllers. Wow. That is USB, so cool, and they're dude. And functional. That's crazy to me. Wow, very, very cool, dude. I am hyped on this. Yeah, I tried finding some of the other original like stuff art that little are, manuals. The stuff that were attached to it and things like that. This was a little promo spot for, I think, Xbox Live at the time. Yeah, there you go. Or like the little back. I'll probably try to find some old ones on eBay or something and just yeah. toss them in there, you know? 
Yeah, that was always one of the thoughts that I had. I just never went about doing it. Got it. It was pretty much just remote storage for me. So okay, I so I was, about, I was about to load it, and this is interesting. He was telling me this Xbox is just what? Just a shell. That's just for just for looks, pretty much. The Kinect is the actual Kinect that's worked up to the Xbox. The Xbox itself is connected down here. Which is this one. So when this was in a store, or in, in the store, it was on a big end cap. So this was all functional to the public and everything like that. However, this would sit on a glass cabinet. And this actually was hidden underneath another panel. Got it, okay. So. That would go in there or to cover would, it? Both. They would cover it up completely. So no one can jack it. So no one can The functioning, jack it. working yes, the Xbox. the actual Xbox. That is crazy. The hidden secrets, man. Yeah. So this was, you, this was yours, right? That was my actual badge. Dang, right. the badge of honor right yeah. here. I love it. Proof. Proof you didn't make up the story to make it just sound cool. Right. <laughs> Dude, yeah. You know I collect vintage clothing. Right. So... <laughs> This no, is it's, awesome. It's not it, this, this is, is some awesome. Of the later stuff it, that we wore before. It, it doesn't matter to me, bro. Anything Toys R Us has my heart, man. I was the definition of a Toys R Us kid. <laughs> For real, though. Like, I really was, so. They were a part of my history. It's a part of my life that I can't relive. And if I did try to relive it, I can't relive it with the same innocence I did when I was a small child. While making this video, I realized that Toys R Us actually had a bigger part in my life than I knew. It helped shape who I am today. The person I am right now is a part of my motto and a staple as who I am as a human being because I don't want to grow up. If you look at me, look at my clothes, look at what I do. I can say as a man in his 30s who plays video games and still plays with toys, I can still proudly say, I don't want to grow up. I'm a Toys R Us kid. Dude, awesome, dude. Yeah. I actually might think that I might try to find a way to properly display this, like yeah, buy sure. this, maybe to kind of give you a little bit of honor in it too, yeah, because no, no, keep the legacy of your employment, you know, alive. I think that'd be good. All right, it is the end of the night and I got it set up, not perfectly the way I want yet, but a little bit because I'm gonna be working on some posters actually back here that I recently just got framed some Nintendo powers. I'm gonna put them right here. But in the meantime, that is what it looks like right now. I'm gonna get some cool Xbox display, obviously to put down there some really cool Xbox items. But for now, simpleness, simpleness, and I'll get it dialed in soon, I promise.